Hello everyone, welcome back to Two Tour to Drive. Um, it's been a while, I do apologise. Uh, today is Salon Privé for the public, or the poor people, whichever way you want to go. Uh, so yeah, we are going to go to Salon Privé. I could walk, but I'm not going to. I'm going to drive, because I want to collect the Jag into the palace. So without further ado, let's go to the palace. And just like that, we have arrived at Salon Privé, and I've got a pretty good spot, to be fair. Not too disappointed with that. Uh, yeah, they just said, Come on straight through. I had a nice car. That was nice. Although compared to the audience around here, it's definitely not anything special. Um, I don't even know where to start, but I'll catch up with everyone in a bit. I honestly don't know how to uh, contemplate today, but uh, I'll try and walk you around and show you everything else. Interestingly, parked opposite this one, it has the yellow calipers because it's carbon ceramics, but I am tempted to do yellow on my Jag. Uh, let me know what you think. Should I put yellow brake calipers on my Jag, which is over there, looking pretty. Hello. For anyone that doesn't know, this is literally my dream poster boy car. Um, do I sell everything, live off baked beans and have one of these? Cash out of every crypto stock in the world that I have, all my savings, and get one of these. <sighs> Sometimes the temptation is there. But yeah, I really want one of these. I don't know if I fit in them though. This is like a day of, do I fit in these cars? Am I allowed to? be associated with this because I have an F-Type? Maybe not, but still, very, very cool. I don't really know how to do this video because there's just so much I, I just can't even contemplate. I mean, GI Yaris's, but no, jokes. GI Yaris's and just everything beyond belief. I mean, <laughs> Jesus. All these great cars around. Uh, the F1 is actually on today. I wouldn't mind watching it, to be honest. Um, so, is there gonna be somewhere shown here at the palace? I don't know, but yeah, Whew, these are nice. So for anyone that doesn't know, uh, this is literally my dream car. <laughs> um, shh, gonna ruin the video. They're all dream cars. Okay, this was a realistic dream car. That says the Ferrari now, I suppose, but I tried to get one of these. I don't know if people follow me on Instagram, but yeah, I don't fit in them basically is my limitation. Otherwise I would definitely have one in a heartbeat, if I'm honest. Um, I would sell the Jag and buy one, uh, but I don't fit. Anyone that thinks differently, well, I wish I did fit. It's beautiful, B-E-A-utiful. I thought I had big tires. These are horrific. I mean, I know you don't look at these and think of the cost of the tires, but poof, sheesh. That is gonna be expensive. Don't, no, I was gonna say, don't touch it. Touch the cars. Beautiful GTA. Had a look for any M2 owner. You cannot join this group because you have an M2. Whereas the F-Type can. F-Type one, nil for the M2. Everything's orange. There's loads to show you, so it's going to be a very weird video to do, but it is one of those. There's lots of people around, which makes videoing super awkward, but we'll get through that. And if you can still hear me, that's a mission, because I am going to mic on this camera, so I do apologise, but yeah, we'll uh, catch up in a bit. Highlight of the day. So I thought this was the... Uh, the car from Fast and Furious, but it turns out it's not. But it looks like it. The one they jump between the buildings. <laughs> Who's more nervous? Porsche owner or the Volvo owner? <laughs> that is a bit tasty. It's almost so quiet, like they're viewing wild animals. No one's like shouting or screaming. It's all just quite a calm environment. <laughs> they're limiting numbers into it. Fair enough. Um, but you got a Chiron. Not the first time I've seen one before. Um, I've seen a few at uh, in uh, in Kidlington, believe it or not, for anyone that knows. So a Bugatti Chiron in Kidlington, an orange one, to be fair. Um, but yeah, this is Tom Hartley, which is very cool. Very, very cool. I'm not gonna shame Brian, but I won't be touching other people's cars, mate. Not on. No, 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 no. 
lots of E-types around here. Very, very nice. Um, I don't think I'd fit in an E-type. This is my restriction with everything I'm looking here. I don't think I'd fit in anything, to be honest. What colour would we have, people? Rainbow of colours here. That's the mines, for anyone interested. Um, I don't know who's doing the safety car this weekend. We're going to try and catch the Formula 1 at 2 o'clock. It's currently 12, so a couple of hours. Yeah. These are incredible. Look at that. I mean... Whew. Oh, my lord. I definitely am not fitting in this, though, am I? Let's be realistic. There's no chance that I'm getting in there anytime soon. So this will have to be another one that can sit with the Alpha 4C as an unattainable because I'm too tall. Seven <laughs> then. No matter where we go, we always end up at Alpine Winchester. <laughs> There's our salmon colour that we drove in a recent video. Uh, in fact, my, most, my last video, we were down here. Um, we drove this car. Uh, I'm still unsure on the colour, I'm going to be honest. It just looks weird. But yeah. This is where we find out that polarised makes a massive difference. Chris is now just seeing colour, because you're probably all seeing black. But uh, if we do that, you can now see the colour. Might have polarised. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think so. Yeah. Yeah, it makes a big difference. Massive difference. But yeah. It's velvety on the top. Yeah, it's like suede. Suede. suede in. Yeah. <laughs> That's going to be good in the rain. Well, yes, like the rest of the car, I'm sure it's green in the rain. To be honest, that was that a jet engine or something? <laughs> the fruit? <laughs> is that a jet engine? Or what? Are we, what is this? That's, uh, I ordered about seven of those, so that could be one of mine. I'm probably looking very peachy right now because it's so hot. But uh, we managed to get the cars all lined up, which looks pretty good. We got uh, Mr. H cars, which I'm sure you know. My car and uh, Will also. We're all Wills actually, all three of us, quite funny. What a beauty that one is. Thank you guys. Lovely. Andrew, your favourite 275. Yeah, my absolute favourite. 275, Competizione Clienti. Incredible, super rare. Thank you so much for bringing her. And we'll see you next year, I hope. Thank you. Thank John for us. Ferrari 166MM, chassis 008M, the most Ferrari, most, sorry, significant Ferrari ever built. Um, raced Le Mans winner 22 it's absolutely famous and thank you for bringing her DK Engineering thank you guys Mercedes 300 SL Goldwyn guys for bringing her along celebrating 60th anniversary and you got it started DK Engineering Harvey oh there you are Bobby. Ferrari 750 Noise. 